Hi guys, we're here with Eric Drifter. Now tell us your name and your own band. Uh, Brandon, I play drums. Byron, I'm guitars. I'm Meredith, I do vocals and play synth. I'm Chris, I play guitar. I'm Marcos, I play bass. Awesome, so where'd you get your name from? Do I want to answer this uh, one? Uh, <laughs> yeah, you're the only you. one that can't answer it. <laughs> He's the only original member. This so. is the only original member. Yeah. Well, uh, when we first started out, we had our old vocalist, Mark. We, well, there was another band from California called Skywalker, and he wanted to go along the same lines as that. So we ended up picking a name close to it, but not exactly, so we sort of stole the name. So but without stealing from it. From Skywalker, you get Air Drifter. Yeah. So yeah. None of us know what Air Drifter really is. And it's a chicken. Kinda, it's a chicken. It's a crazy a looking chicken. It's the running it's joke of the turtle. band that none of us yeah. know what Air Drifter is. Or air fresheners. <laughs> Fun fact, or if he was going to be named, what is Air Drifter? Yeah. Just because of that. We don't know. No, but none of us know what yeah. an Air Drifter it's is. A chicken, guys. If you can it's tell us what an Air Drifter is, that'd be cool. It's a chicken, I'm saying. It's a chicken. A chicken drifts in the air because it can't fly. It's too damn fast. Yeah. That's what I heard. Sorry. Well, like, what's that? Okay. We're a bunch of retards, don't mind that. Okay. Bye, so, how did you get to your lineup now? So, like, what's the band's history? Oh, um, okay. that, that's, 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 a long, okay. that's a long story. A three year run right there. Alright, he's the only original member. Then they got Marcos. Who was actually supposed to be original, fun fact, originally our manager. He ended up going to bass. No, drummers. We went through several drummers. Too many. We got, they got me. And it was like then it was no. <laughs> they got me as they kicked Mark they kicked Mark out and got me. And so it was us three and another guitarist and Brandon Padilla as our drummer. And then we went for a while and then we forced <laughs> forced. We forced Chris Poop. <laughs> we forced Chris Poop to join the band. Well he forced him. <laughs> Marcos forced him. Yeah, and then, I told him he's never, he's never. And then Marcos ended up picking up. Uh, no, no, I, I, just, I didn't. Oh, thank you. Not that Marcos. Yeah. And I was like, hey. And we kicked shit. out our drummer. Don't forget Shoreline. Yeah. Oh yeah, well, from our old band, Shoreline. And so. we got Randon, and yeah, that's how we were Got two new security guards. <laughs> yeah, we're <laughs> yeah. We got security guards. Yeah. Did you, what'd you grab out of his pocket? Glasses. <laughs> <laughs> that's perfect. That's big. You don't fuck with them. Awesome. Okay, so. Biggie Smalls. Biggie Smalls. Biggie Smalls. Yeah. Alright, next question. So if you were in the zombie apocalypse, who would be the first to die and who would be the leader? Hands down! Hands <laughs> down! No, 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 you I'd die first. first. Yeah, die. You can't run. Yeah. Here, random fact, I'm semi-paralyzed, so I can't run. Um, he'd probably he'd probably outrun everybody. Surprisingly, he can actually run. He can, he can run. I've seen him run. He runs fast. Marcos is very good at it. He could pass off as a zombie. I, I, he I, might I actually think, survive. I think he'd be the first to die. And Chris would be the leader. Chris would be, Chris would be yeah, Chris would be the last leader. Just, oh yeah, I just go if you want to go by movie facts, she would be the second to uh, second to last person. I'd probably be right after Marcos and then him. Dude, I'd be in can of beans and chill in the woods. <laughs> okay, he just disappeared. <laughs> yeah, he would disappear. I That's know. normal though. Like, what the hell is random? I got four shotguns. <laughs> I'll go to like. Big you scare me. I go to the That's Caribbean racist. and just like kill in a chill in a cave no, like, or something. Go to like a random mouse and you're hiding that shack over there because it looks creepy as fuck. Dude, that's the Girl Scout sweatshop. That's where all the little really? like, yeah. demon ah, children. Well, okay. <laughs> that's where they go make all the. Oh, good to know. Anyway. Um. <laughs> um Free cookies. Yes. Okay. What was the first thing that you um did that made you want to be a musician? So if you listen to a certain album and you're like, I don't like that. Or Concert or like I, <laughs> I want to go down the line. Yeah. Sure. Uh, I pretty much just kind of grew up around music. Some of like my older friends that I grew up with just started playing music and then kind of just followed into me getting into it through them. Started playing drums and turned into like a family band. Like within a moment from there, it just started branching off into a bunch of different bands. Uh, me, I was, my dad always played guitar, but I always wanted to be a drummer. But I could, <laughs> my dad wouldn't, uh, my dad would not put up with the fact of me being extremely fucking loud like an idiot. And so he instead bought me a guitar, and I ended up taking guitar lessons, and now I'm here, been in like two bands. That's it. <laughs> um, my parents pretty much forced me to pick up guitar, and then I put that down and picked up the cello. And I've been singing pretty much my whole life, so I really love that, and I kind of wanted to take it to a new level, so I joined a band with my friends in high school. That didn't exactly work out, and then I found Air Drifter, so that's where I'm at. Okay, baby. <laughs> Just short my short my grandpa was a session musician for the Beatles, so I was always around music growing up. I didn't know that. Yeah, it's true. 
All those guitars I have from his, I was used for the Beatles. Is that the only one in the band that knew that? Yeah. yeah okay. You know, like, yeah. All right, nobody cares. Anyways, yeah, so I grew up around it, didn't take it seriously until I was like 12, and I just, I took maybe six months of guitar lessons and just went from there to start buying guitars. Now you took guitar lessons too? Huh? For like six months. I all took I, mine for all four I did years. was learn Nirvana covers. <laughs> I, I'm, a, I'm a classical guitar player. So. My turn. My turn. Uh, my stepfather uh, showed me Stevie Ray Vaughan back when I was like six years old, and then just the sound of the guitar just really like hit me, and it just made me want to be a musician. And then I started hearing like Stevie Ray Vaughan. Uh, uh, what's his name? You know his name, the Ibanez Jones. Steve Vai. Steve Vai. Uh, and then I was playing guitar for 12 years, and then I got I got forced to play bass for my other band. I was uh, going to be their guitar player, and then there a lot of stuff happened. I became a bass player. And I, There's definitely something wrong with Esther. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up, Byron. But basically, I was forced to play bass, and I, I learned it, and I love playing bass. It's the only thing that I really enjoy music-wise. Alright, well, I know we were talking about this earlier, but embarrassing uh -huh. moments. Wait, at practice or on stage? Every time. Every time. Like, all with the band. Everything. With the band? With um, band. Battle of the Fans, interesting fact. I almost fell off the stage when I went for my pedal. Yeah. I missed. I literally went to go hit the pedal and I went like that. Because I couldn't <laughs> find the floor. I think I top everyone with embarrassing moments. I almost flashed. I did flash everyone at a house show. I saw that That one. was That was <laughs> hilarious. She like lit her screen I up. jumped up and I was wearing this dress and I my uh, dress came up and I flashed everyone at a house show. Okay, that mine, mine yeah. uh, when we played at House of Blues uh, like two years ago. Yeah, that's the same show I almost fell on stage. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention and I literally stepped off the edge of the stage and I caught myself by landing on my ass. <laughs> oh, you did fall! Uh, not mine. I was really, really sick on tour with my old band. Uh, it was last year, April. And in Idaho's fall, I don't never forget this. I puked on stage. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like, blah! Justin Bieber. That's Everybody gross. else was like, that's brutal as fuck, man. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> He's like, I can't yeah. believe I did that. I'm over here, like, dying 110 degrees, you know, 110 fever. Puking everywhere, and everyone's like, that's so brutal stuff. Like, Here, here's a tip, I gotta buy a shirt. It'd like, <laughs> be even more brutal if it was blood. That's true. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. can't imagine that. Okay. Brandon, 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 what? <laughs> He's like, I'm like, well, I would have to say it was with my last band. We were playing at like the junkyard. I don't know Sitting by the drums, right? and I have like this weird thing where I hear a really high pitched frequency, I get really dizzy, and I just kind of like lose my equilibrium. <laughs> so I'm just sitting there, and Sal and Sergio were messing with something, and I just hear all this, and I get dizzy. I fall off my seat, and behind me is like a five, six foot drop on the concrete. I fall backward. I, I, I didn't know it was back there, so I just fell, hit the ground, and I'm just laying there, just, ah. <laughs> I think everyone has stage issues. Yeah. yeah. Falling, throwing up, and yeah. flashing. Flashing. <laughs> Inappropriateness, Meredith. <laughs> oh, yeah, of course. We're not, it wouldn't be, it wouldn't we're be not in good New Orleans. Come on, we're not in the French Quarter. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so say if you have like a conflict like, with someone else or you can't get through something, like, how do you get through like a conflict? Fight. <laughs> we argue and argue and argue. When do we ever settle yeah, anything? It's like band practice players. turns into Mortal Kombat. Yeah. <laughs> we visit. We. I gotta be. I gotta be the referee and be like, hey, knock the fuck out. Hey, this is interesting. I punched our, yeah, I punched our, our old drummer in the face. Ah, yeah! <laughs> Punch Vinia in the face, that was great! Yeah, dude, you can join the party guards. Party guards? Party guards? Yeah. Uh, there's that. There's that. Originally, when we face. were a four piece, when it was me, Mark, Dylan, and Alex, uh, we actually decided to settle disputes by getting MMA gloves and actually going at it. Okay! <laughs> I just stop and stop. Needless, oh, needless to say, I just get slammed by Alex every time, so it's just... Ugh. And when Marcus and I get in dispute, I just grab his nipples. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck you guys. That was a good way to settle things. Okay, so, two really tiny questions. DC or Marvel? What? DC. I, DC. DC. Yeah. Are you kidding me? Batman. Marvel. I will fight Go you away. over Batman. Get out of the band. I don't get out of the band. I don't look, look, look you comics or any of that shit. I'm not really much of a carpet comic fan, but I can choose Marvel. Oh my god, not gonna say. Not gonna say. Oh, are you want to save me, Randy? Come on. Oh, no, Asshole. Yeah. Do you guys see all of them? So there was a bug, like a bee just like landed on my back. I saw that. I went flipped out. Okay. 
Xbox. 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 What the hell? Yeah, Xbox. I don't play PlayStation. 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 Xbox. You know what? You know what? Hey, PlayStation Game or Xbox. Xbox. Yeah. I have an Xbox. Xbox. Yeah. But I still like Sony. But I still like Sony. Fuck that, dude. Final Fantasy and shit. GameCube. Yes, I still have one. And it's I just bought one like two days ago. I plugged in my second controller and they'll still have the Dude, are you like way behind in technology right now? <laughs> I'm still thing as a PS4. Not PS4. Uh, PSP. I have to say the Xbox One, retarded. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. I'm an Xbox guy, but that's the yeah. most retarded thing I've ever seen. See, really PS4 was. is just so pretty. Like, I want to get one. Work for they look the same. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, musical guilty pleasure. Like, you're listening to something, but you don't want anybody else to know. In sync. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he kind of does get down. Shit, this is a hard one. This is a hard one. I listen to a lot. Brad Paisley. I'm like, I listen to country. Shoot. Yes. I love Jam Brad Paisley. James Taylor and Justin Timberlake. Yeah. Hey. Lady Gaga. Mark. Oh, oh, Lady Gaga. Katie. Oh, high five. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Did we just Lady become best friends? Lost a member. I guess so. Marcos, you're fired. We want to keep him. Okay. <laughs> okay, do you know senior superlatives like most likely to be oh, this? Oh, gosh. I have okay. three of them. <laughs> oh, dear so, God. Or four of them, actually. I can't count. So most likely to be a comedian. Comedian? Random. Random? Random. I don't, I don't get it. I, I don't see it. <laughs> me. I don't Trust see me, it. it's usually the silent ones that make everyone laugh. Probably. Okay, I guess random. Okay, most likely to be a super villain. Marco! Oh, 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 oh. That's <laughs> the that's possibly the gayest <laughs> super villain last I've ever heard. Whoa! Yeah. Oh. 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 Okay, oh. so most likely to be a superhero. Um, nobody's good here. I have the same hair though. Why? I don't know, she's the nicest out of everybody. This is Bear Bear the Cuddling Dragon. Hi guys. Okay. <laughs> um, last one, most likely a president. President? That would be uh, Chris. That would be Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Hands down. Done. That would be Chris. Hands awesome. down. I have no idea. I'm the retard. You talk about more patients than that when you just long hair. Shave hair, man. Okay. Are you a bald chain? Okay. Yeah, sure. Okay. So, your EP. What's the meaning behind the songs? Is it like directed towards something? Okay, I can ex I can explain Is it. Is it about her? No, 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 this is all her. <laughs> Alright, the whole theme of the EP is Breaking Point. That's the whole theme of the EP, it's the cover track. Um, the whole EP is basically just about, you know, your breaking point and uh, there's always something that pushes you to that point and everybody has that breaking point that it's hidden deep inside of them and there's just something that's going to push them over the edge to, to break. And that's what the cover art is about too. It's two. It's one. It's one person sitting at a table. Stop it! And one person's on the light side, and one person's on the dark side. And she's reaching over to the dark side. So basically, any person has. Every person has their point, and it's part of who they are, I guess. And it breaks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. Ah, <laughs> uh, I see what you guys did there. It also helps because light side off. Yeah, dark light side. side. Yeah. Oh, that's exactly what I'm talking about. We're half and half. Awesome. Okay, Technical so. easy corn one. <laughs> I have a hot pot. Who do you look up to? Like, who's your kid or family or like, who keeps you like going? Or just like a, as a whole band or individual? Like individually. Whole, whole band individually. and buddy yeah, raises. Like, who do you look up to? I don't know, buddy raises and shit. Me, I like, like white chocolate. Like, this metal, is the, carnifex, this is, you know? This is funny, yeah. Yeah, but I was like, pop and shit. As a whole yeah. band, City Lights. Yeah. We're the in crowd. Yeah. We're the in crowd. Yeah. Yeah. Chunk and chunk and chunk. Definitely yeah. chunk. Uh, yeah. They didn't remember. Yeah, those are our band influences. She likes the fun. summer set. I do too. I, I love don't the play summer it. set. I saw the next game thing. Oh, yeah. I, I ended up I ended up getting into them somehow. Yeah. I don't know how, but I ended up... I, I don't like them on album. I like them live. Too. I've I, never seen them live yet. Oh, wait. Yes, yes. definitely. FTSK? We have a lot of influences. We have way too many. No, I have way too hey, many. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay, last Never. one. Truth or dare with the band. Oh, dear oh God. So basically, oh my one gosh. of you guys has to like dare someone else. We can do two or three. Like last interview, we did like a coma sign and um. I saw tonight we fight. That was hilarious. Someone kissed Zach's ass. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm not sure who it was. I think it was either Chris or Tyler. Someone got there someone got into a trash can on tonight we fight. That was Brian. Someone jumped off that thing over there, and then some from um the Colorado. Someone like. 
Oh, I was just about to say. I'm hey, not. No, I'm this. not licking okay. a dude's chest. So it's up to no. you guys. Um, they can get involved too. So just start thinking up. <laughs> it's usually just dare or dare. No one is true. Yeah, dare. True. I mean, like, Biggie chose. Marcus, truth or dare? <laughs> it's dare. Oh, it's, it's dare or dare. It's dare or dare. You can't. Uh, dare or double dare. How about that? Exactly. Double top dare. 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 You were we talking about nipple, nipples and shit. I dare you to lick Biggie's nipples. <laughs> You were yeah. dared. You gotta do it. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's saying no. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna he's go for the band members. Strictly secure. Yeah. Well, yeah. You said you guys get involved, so. Oh, we decided I not to. All right. Look at how big that man. guy is. Look how small I am. <laughs> not doing it. <laughs> he will break you. Yeah. Yes. With his nipple. Yeah. Yes. Do we do another band members? No. Lick Randon's nipple. <laughs> well, it's his turn. He already pussied out. Yeah, yeah I pussied out. Oh, wow. was he? Never. All right. Brandon, do the deck. Oh! No. I'll do it, Aaron. What do you want me to do? Backflip. Oh. Are you in the kiss bar? That's not even a dare. That's just something ridiculously sexual and awkward. <laughs> That's just basically a dare. I mean, I'll yeah. see your view. Oh, I would really do that. That's not even a dare. Or what would you think? No. Nah, I think it's good. I think it's fun. How about, how about you, Darius? Just pick someone. Oh, that's all I'm talking Pick something. Come on. Quick, man. Yeah, I'll pick something. Pick something else. I don't think he's going to kiss me, and I know I don't want to kiss him. Exactly. Alright. Alright, I dare you to go climb on top of uh, that roof. Oh, um, that? Kick that pool. Yeah. That's <laughs> <That's> so <laughs> mean. No. no. I'm sorry. I have to choose a good hair. Uh, like I did, so am I really climbing that? Yep. Sure. Yeah. Um, you can fall. <laughs> yeah, you can like fall. Up. All right. <laughs> Where is that? Uh, this is I like don't ready. Ready. Hey, I'm good. What did you say? He said lick Biggie's nipple. Oh yeah, that looks good. Yeah. That's what he was doing. Yeah. No, if you punch yeah. him, I go blind. That's such a fun dare. Sorry, go up there too. What? Are we gonna owl? <laughs> yeah, dude. Ah. So what now? <laughs> The whole bear is just an owl up there. Ow! <laughs> Alright, can we not hurt ourselves now, before we play? what kind of is that? I don't even How know. How am I getting down? It's a lame. If you're not scared of heights. Blink, you fall off. Tuck and roll. What now? Jump and tuck and roll. Hell no. You need no. to dare someone. Dare you look like you have good ideas. Shuffle. Huh. I don't know. I don't remember how to do the truffle shuffle. Just dance. Do some footwork up there. You're retarded. Sure you don't die. Let me see you shuffle. Yeah. So is it my turn? Yeah. I dare Chris to do the truffle shuffle hanging upside down from the tree. Do it! What does that even mean? I'm too fat to climb a tree. How are we gonna do this? Okay, I'll climb a tree. I'm supposed to Just jump off! I don't wanna die over there. Wait, there's a good tree. That's a good tree right there. I feel like a good tree. Oh, sorry. Help! Stop! Someone call the fire department. You can not climb a tree, Chris? Ah! That's mm -hmm. You need a boost to climb a tree. Do you, have you seen how fat I am? Do <laughs> you see how low this tree is? Right. Hey, where am I going? <laughs> oh my god. Don't grab his ass. Oh my god. Give me your foot. <laughs> this is funny. <laughs> this is funny. I like this. The branch will probably break because he's a 400 pound Hitler. Yep. <laughs> I thought he was Jesus. No, he's supposed Hitler. to be the. Jesus was not this fat. Aww. Jesus was not this fat. Alright. He, he might if actually you die. You yourself before the show. No, no, no. We only will. need his hand. <laughs> this branch? Yeah, we only need his hands. Just turn around and sit down. backwards. Lock your legs around the tree. Shut yeah. the fuck up. <laughs> I'm a fucking bomb? monkey. Let him do his own dance. Where you wrap your legs around and swing? No. Just wrap your legs around. <laughs> no, that was my scared ball for him now. I'm pretty scared. Not, like, <laughs> He's not very coordinated. I can tell he can't climb a tree. Bro, I'm a cook, not a fucking clean tree climber. <laughs> Whoa. Go, go, Biggie, go. grab his leg. Yeah, grab his legs, bro. Can we not lose our guitars? Truffle shuffle. <laughs> 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 What kind of truffle shuffle is that? Like he's not, he's not as fat! That was fantastic! But that was like the Blair Fiction interview, like, title screen. Yes! <laughs> that's gonna be a sample for, like, oh, intro. That okay, awesome! Did you see those rolls? <laughs> Alright, Meredith still has to do something. Oh, okay. You haven't done anything! This is gonna be the last one, I'm gonna end with the closing pose. So, right. we need to get dare. Um, Alright, I need to get dare. Real dare. Nothing ridiculous. Fire.
Wait, Bayern has... Oh, Bayern has... I climbed with Randy. He climbed on... He climbed on... It's Randy's turn, that was his dare. Oh no, Chris, no, it's Chris's. Oh yeah. Huh? Chris, is your dare? It's your dare? Yeah, you dare her. Or whoever. Or whoever you want. Oh, I Marcos hasn't done anything. I pushed it I know you did. I did. Wham. I did to do the wobble and it's not good. Do it. You want it. Do the wobble. Okay. Wobble, baby. Wobble. Wobble, yep. baby. Wobble. That's even funny. Oh, I actually have the song. What up? What up? Go next to the camera, if anything. Yeah. Do you have the song? Hey, hold on. Give me a minute. I'm sure she could play the song. In the background? Yeah, in the background. Yeah. Just go do it. Just keep it like that. Yeah, just be like that. That'd be awkward. Complete <laughs> silence. <laughs> silence is gone. Right. Awesome. Thank you guys. Just end out with a funny pose. So you guys can get in too and do a pose if you'd like. No, we're... Okay. We're just being the Body background. Body guard, people, you can come up. Yeah, like just do a funny pose. Something crazy. Posse jump. Posse jump? I can't jump. Oh, wait. Yeah. Mark, this is Marco's jumping. Yeah. Alright, ready guys? One. Wait, what's Mark doing? Three. Woo! Yeah! Awesome, we're done. Thank you guys. Bye. Bye. Bye.